number of men and women around you. One out of three women and one out of five men will experience osteoporotic fracture over the fifties. The fractures can occur in any bone, but specifically in the vertebra. Crushed vertebra can cause severe back pain. It sometimes may reduce the height and uh, cause deformation in the body and will cause the patient to lose independency, which means simple tasks like going to the washroom will need assistance. Conventional solution for that is surgery, with its all well-known risks and drawbacks. Not even mentioning how critical is the site of the surgery in the spine. Alternative solution is a solution in which a needle is injected in the crushed vertebra. A paste-like material called bone cement is injected in. The paste will become solid and restore the strength of the vertebra, which may sound good. But the story is not ending happily ever after. The success rate of this procedure is very dependent on the properties of that bone cement. Currently used bone cement are polymeric based. They are causing uh, immediate and long-term problems in the surrounding tissue. Another type of bone cement, which is good in biological properties, is mechanically weak and brittle. In my research, I'm working on a new type of bone cement which is similar to the concrete in the building construction. We've modified that, and as you may guess, it has a very high uh, strength. And it has shown very good biological properties as well. It's biocompatible, but it likes it. And it's bioactive, which means it will make direct bonding with bone cells and the bone sites. It will communicate with bone cells. But it's resistant to fracture, and cracks is not enough. So I have used micro-sized biocompatible fiber to reinforce it. So it's tough. But on top of all of these, it has a unique ability, self-healing, which means if a crack is formed inside of it, the crack will be omitted and removed after soaking it in a liquid similar to the uh, liquid in the body, simulated body fluid. And how does that happen? There are small crystals of the mineral part of or a natural bone precipitating inside of the crack, and the crack will be stitched up. So in my research, uh, we are building up the building in the bone with a material which is a strong, tough, biocompatible, bioactive, and it has the ability of self-healing. What do you want more from a bone cement, aside from custom-made coloring that we're working on? Thank <laughs> you.